What's up gamers? Gamerdad here. This is a guide to help me complete the Champions Road quest, Capture the Floating Loot Island. If you haven't subscribed or used my creator code yet, please do so. I truly appreciate the support. So for this challenge, you need to wait for the Floating Loot Island to appear. And that is because it will not appear until Storm 3 of 12. So when you jump off the battle bus, you'll even be at storm zero. There's no storm happening. And then as the game progresses, the storm will move in and the circle will move tighter and tighter. And each time the storm moves, that will be counted. And once you reach the storm three of 12 mark, that is when you will be able to, to actually see the loot island and then actually go up to it and try to claim it. So the key here is land somewhere off of the battle bus where you're comfortable getting some loot. I was landing here because I knew there were a few chests as well I was also going for a different challenge. Once I completed that challenge I knew I was ripe and ready to move on to this one here. And that is because it does not happen until the late game. So there's 25 people left basically in this game and I'm just waiting for that storm 3 of 12. Now the key here is getting yourself a vehicle, especially the sports car. because. You want to put yourself in a position where you, you're ready when you see where the floating loot island is because it will spawn randomly. So once you hit the storm 3 of 12, be on a place like a hilltop in the middle of the area where you are. I'm pretty close. And then the moment you see this, you go for that place. You mark it on the map and then drive there. I'm 200 meters away. You can see it literally took me seconds to get here. Now, once the island appears, you need to get up there. There's two ways. There'll be some rifts, which look like little portals that you can walk into on the ground. They'll transport you into the air, and then you could glide onto the floating loot island. Alternatively, and the most easiest way of them all, is to use one of these ascenders. So that's like a zip line that goes up and down. So you come up to it. For me, I push the square, I will zip up. Now, here's the key. You need to get near this flag. This is how you claim. There's also a circle on the ground, and you need to stay within this circle on your own. Another player cannot enter this circle. If, the player, if another player enters the circle, you must eliminate them. But there is a diamond. You can see it is filling up with a blue or cyan color. The longer you stay in the circle, the more of that diamond will fill in. And once the diamond has been fully filled in, the flagpole will have reached the top, and you will have claimed Loot Island. Once it's claimed, it cannot be claimed again. And I'm playing Battle Royale, so I built this up so that another player would have to kind of come in here and they can't just, you know, walk in and start taking me out. And as I know I'm going to complete this challenge and claim the island, I get rid of that just for a nice little shot here. So you stay here. Once it reaches the top, you're going to get some sweet loot. You'll have captured the floating loot island, and your champion's road quest is now complete. I do hope the guide is helpful. Please drop a like, leave me a comment, and if you haven't subscribed or used my creator code, please do so. I truly appreciate your support. Good luck, and until the next video... This is Gamerdad, out.